in this lesson we discuss about the what is the array and uh, how to declare the simple uh, how to declare the simple array in the rpg le program first uh, what is the meaning of uh, array is array is a collection of uh, similar objects just like uh, many other programming the definition is the array is the collection of uh, similar similar data types or similar objects here um, in the rpg le array is a collection of similar data types for example you want to uh, save the save the some 10 numbers into one uh, single uh, single variable if you want to save the 10 numbers you, you are uh, saving that in the separate take the separate variable names and uh, you store that variables into stum, uh, some values into that fields mm, uh, that is that is not possible uh, for uh, uh, saving the 100 uh, 100 customer details has uh, 100 uh, like that information so we, uh, at that time we, have, we want to declare the one array here and that array we are storing the same as that 100 well 100 student names 100 100 numbers like that information uh, in this rpg early, array is uh, declared just like a simple variable declaration uh, in this uh, example uh, again uh, the arrays are classified into three types first one is the uh, runtime array pre runtime array and runtime array compiled diagram array and uh, pre runtime array so these are the three types of arrays in the rpg only first to uh, uh, discuss about the how to declare a simple array in rpg le program here the uh, our array name is uh, just like a variable name a1 this is the standalone type and uh, the length of the name uh, length is the four four digits length and uh, uh, the array size is the four here so the the dim dim is a keyword for um, keyword for declaring the array in the keyword section write the dim what is the length of uh, your array so for example you are uh, saving the 100 customer details here so put it uh, as a 100 like that so this is the length how many for um, you want to uh, our number size is, oh, save the number size here so here i declared as a five, five four like that you take the one more i'm taking the one more variable hi i i is uh, initialized as a <laughs> i is a one uh, integer uh, john integer john integer here so in this example we are declared the one array array size is the array size what is the array size in this uh, the array size is the 4 and uh, the it contains the uh, integer type of information so it contains the four integers okay how to initialize the variable uh, initialize the array in the code in the code itself we can uh, initialize the using the eval, eval keyword in this uh, array a1 the first two element is 1 so uh, the first element 1 is initialized with the 10 and uh, second uh, integer is uh, a second array element is initialized with the 11 second element is initialized with the 111 and uh, like that third element fourth element is initialized with the 15 and uh, using the So you want to display the particular element of the array. Use the a1 of you if you want to display the fourth element. Put it here for four. And if you want uh, in this uh, example, I am taking the one uh, loop for the displaying the all variables in the array for for i equals to 1 to 4 by increment by 1 so 
and the compile time it is equal to four times so i, to, I equal to one to four and it is incremented by one and uh, the it is displaying the what is the that uh, array of uh, i element is uh, displayed on the our screen like this way we are writing the uh, simple array okay so what is the array array is the collection of uh, similar variables or uh, similar elements in this example the, our first element is 10 so displayed first iteration second iteration third iteration and fourth iteration 